Apple's AirPods, and AirPods Pro have been one of the most widely recognizable truly wireless earbuds on the market, and not just because they are made by Apple. They provide a wonderful user experience, fantastic noise cancelling, and mind-blowing spatial audio for those already invested in Apple's ecosystem. But what if you use Android? Will you be able to experience the magic? Or are you better off considering some of the other options on the market? Let's get started! Hey guys, welcome to Gadgetsu. I'm Fenson, and today I'm here to tell you about my experience using the AirPods Pro on Android. Starting off with the hardware, the build quality is superb, except for the fact that the hard plastic case gets scratched easily, which is why I have mine in a cheap silicon case. The lid of the case is also extremely satisfying, I mean, listen to this click. The earbuds themselves are also one of the most comfortable earbuds I have ever worn, thanks to the air vents on the side, which remove any pressure clogged up in your ears. I mean, they're so comfortable and the transparency mode is so good that I often forget that I'm wearing them and have a mini heart attack every time I check the case. Anyways, moving on to the features. The ANC and transparency modes are game changer. The ANC works surprisingly well for commuters, as they just seal off the world around you, and the transparency mode is perfect for listening around the house or biking. Lastly, the connection on any device, whether you're on Android or iOS, is just lightning fast. I mean, check this out. Now, for the downsides of being on Android. You lose Siri, the ear tip test, and the ability to turn on and off the ANC and transparency mode. But honestly, what are you going to use those? The one thing you do lose, however, is the battery indicator. But don't you worry about that, because here are some of my favorite apps to help with the battery problem, and one app that will revolutionize your listening experience, so make sure to stay until the end of the video. The first app on this list is Material Pods. Out of all the battery indicator apps I could find on the Google Play Store, this was the most reliable and pleasing option. The design of the pop-up is super minimal and great looking, with options for 2D or 3D pop-ups to suit your preference. There is also a notification that pops up, indicating your battery percentage. You can also unlock more customizability features, and even enable the assistant trigger with the app for around 2 bucks. This is a must-get for any AirPods user on Android. This next app is Assistant Trigger. This app is great for people who are looking to replace Siri functionality on their AirPods with Google Assistant. A simple triple tap does the trick and it's really fast as well. And best of all, there's also a battery pop-up shade included if you don't mind a different design and slightly slower pop-up leads. There is a pro version, however, if you wanted to dive more deeply into its customizability features. And finally, what you've all been waiting for, the glorious app that dramatically improves the sound quality on your AirPods, Wavelet. This app is game changer. What this app does is store an EQ profile for each individual pair of headphones you own for music apps like Spotify. There is a database of pre-existing profiles you can choose from, or if you're more of an audiophile, a custom tuner. My favorite preset is the AirPods Pro Auto EQ at 60% strength and a slightly lowered bass boost. You can fine tune this to your own discretion, but trust me, it is definitely worth trying. I mean, before this app, I never wanted to take out my AirPods Pro because of its mediocre sound quality. But now that the app has dramatically improved the sound, I choose these 9 times out of 10 compared to my much better sounding Soundcord Liberty 2 Pros. To wrap things up, the AirPods Pro is definitely an excellent option for everyone, whether you're on Team iOS or Android. And as many reviewers have said, the AirPods Pro is the most complete package of any truly wireless earbud you can find on the market right now, and I definitely agree with them, but only if you can afford them. 
If not, don't worry, because there's so many other options on the market right now. If you guys are looking for earbud reviews, I suggest you check out channels like Gameski and El Hefe. And that's it for today guys, please leave a thumbs up if you liked this video, and if you didn't, please tell us how we can improve down below. Lastly, consider subscribing to help kickstart this channel. Alright, see you guys later!